Good morning, everyone. This is your girl, Shirley Strawberry. A million dollar fraud scheme and a lot of victims. This all happened through an alleged growth and coaching business. Part of it run on social media. But please say there could be more victims. Yeah, he need to be making six figures to keep her happy. Now, you got two jobs that ain't making six figures. Shirley Strawberry, an accomplished American radio host, actor, writer, television personality, and author, has recently found herself making headlines, unfortunately, for all the wrong reasons. While Shirley herself remains fortunate enough to be safe, her husband, businessman Ernesto Williams, is currently facing difficulties. Although Shirley is widely recognized for her notable contributions to The Monique Show, specifically Strawberry Letter, and her involvement in Medea Goes to Jail. There exists an undisclosed aspect of her personal life, shrouded in darkness, which many are unaware of. Her husband, Ernesto Williams, is purportedly a deadbeat tenant who owes his former landlord thousands of dollars in rent and damages. But that is little in comparison to the latest allegations that he molested youngsters physically. And guess who's been assisting him in doing that? Steve Harvey, Shirley's boss and comedian. So what's the story behind all this? We'll spill all the details you probably missed in today's video. But of course, before I spill anything, make sure first that you subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell for more updates and videos like this. Now let's dive in. 57-year-old Ernest Williams or Nesto and 46-year-old Erica King or Erica Hughley allegedly promised an improved life for a cause. When you think about it, you 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 can't live without her. No, sir. It, is is she the woman of your dreams? Yes, sir. Recently, a man sharing the same name as Shirley Strawberry's husband made headlines when he was arrested and charged with possession of, let's just say, inappropriate content on his computer. Social media has been buzzing with suspicions that this accused individual might indeed be Shirley's husband, and there are valid reasons behind these speculations. During a live-streamed bail hearing, details of the arrest emerged. According to the police, a single photograph was found on the man's computer, leading to his charges. Additionally, the man who was reportedly charged alongside a woman who is described as his extramarital partner. The involvement of Shirley's co-host, Steve Harvey, has shocked netizens even further. It is crucial to clarify that neither Steve nor Shirley were directly involved in the alleged crimes. However, it is claimed that Steve Harvey played a role in aiding the accused individual in evading prosecution. Investigation first started at this home on Pine Grove Road months ago. Investigators say after Williams and King hadn't paid rent for a while, detectives started looking into their financial transactions. The arrest of this man, who has a history of criminal activities including fraud and armed robbery, occurred during his bail hearing due to the discovery of the material on his computer. Interestingly, both Steve and Shirley have been mentioned in relation to this controversy, with the iconic comedian being accused of assisting the accused individual in escaping punishment and seeking refuge at Steve's residence in Abu Dhabi. Although Ernesto's lawyer did not explicitly state that his client is married to Shirley, some hints were dropped during the court proceedings. Notably, Ernesto's attorney revealed that his wife is a person of public notoriety, inadvertently disclosing the name Shirley Strawberry as the wife in question. Now, here comes the astonishing part. As revealed during the bail hearing, the prosecution claims to have intercepted conversations from Ernesto's phone involving multiple individuals. They assert that Ernesto was in contact with an alleged mistress and had intentions of leaving Atlanta to escape to Florida with her. Furthermore, the prosecutor mentioned overhearing a call between Ernesto and his wife wherein it was alleged that his wife's boss, potentially Steve Harvey, possessed a secondary residence in Abu Dhabi and was willing to offer it to Ernesto as a safe haven to avoid facing legal consequences. Essentially position themselves as experts in the fields of business growth, development, coaching, things of that nature. It appears that Ernesto and Steve Harvey share a close friendship, spanning several years. In fact, Steve played a significant role in introducing Shirley to Ernesto and he even had the honor of walking Shirley down the aisle during their wedding ceremony. It is worth noting that Ernesto is the proud proprietor of Ernesto Cuts, a thriving business in the men's cosmetics industry, 
that has flourished for over two decades. Shirley and Ernesto's journey began in 2013, and their relationship has remained strong ever since. In a beautiful and unforgettable moment, Ernesto proposed to Shirley live on his radio show in 2015, and the couple joyfully exchanged vows later that same year. When you think about it, you, you, you can't live without her? No, sir. Is, is, is she the woman of your dreams? Yes, sir. Show Shirley a diamond ring. Yeah. Will you marry me? What? I will marry you. While details about Shirley's previous marriage remain undisclosed, it was evident that her current relationship with Ernesto was filled with love and support until the unfortunate onset of deception. Less than a year ago, the Roswell police made arrests in connection to a million-dollar business scheme. The investigation revealed that a 57-year-old man named Ernest Williams, along with a 46-year-old woman named Erica King, had convinced numerous individuals to pay them for their supposed business expertise. The investigation initially focused on their residence in Pine Grove Road, where it was discovered that Williams and King had failed to pay rent, prompting detectives to delve into their financial activities. The Roswell police officer involved in the case stated, they would then align themselves with their victims with the promise of being able to grow their life goals, their missions, their brands, their social media followings, even to help them to cut the kind of high-end vehicles they wanted to drive. However, it was revealed that the suspects never delivered any services, and the entire endeavor turned out to be a fraudulent scheme. The officer further disclosed, we have identified more than a dozen victims who have reported over $1 million in monetary and property losses to our department. The investigation into Ernest and his accomplice initially began in June of last year, focusing on a case involving rental fraud at a property located on the 900 block of Pine Grove Road. As detectives delved into their financial transactions, it became evident that Ernesto and Miss King were involved in an elaborate business scheme. Presently, multiple charges of fraud, forgery, and theft remain against both individuals. The evidence suggests that Ernesto is undeniably involved in criminal activities, and given his close friendship with Steve Harvey, it raises the possibility of their collaboration. While Shirley and Ernesto's relationship may have started on a positive note, the future now appears grim and uncertain. Prior to meeting Ernesto, Shirley Strawberry had an impressive career in broadcasting, with over 25 years of experience a successful show, and even an NAACP Image Award-winning book. However, she realized that she had not actively pursued a serious relationship in over five years. Reflecting on her situation, she acknowledged that she needed to make an effort and create space in her life for a partner. She recognized the importance of taking action rather than solely relying on faith, stating, faith without works is dead. Determined to prioritize her personal happiness and peace of mind, Shirley made positive changes in her life. She focused on improving her health by adopting a better diet and engaging in regular workouts, leading to some weight loss. She also deepened her connection with God through prayer and made adjustments to her wardrobe, choosing figure-flattering dresses and toning down her accessories to enhance her natural beauty. Shirley explains, I not only learned to love myself, but also to like the person I saw in the mirror. I became more vocal about my desires and feelings. She recognized that it is unnecessary to personally experience something negative to understand its impact, comparing it to not needing to get hit by a subway train to know it's dangerous. Shirley embraced new experiences, meeting Ernesto in 2013 through a mutual friend. They connected instantly, sharing personal stories and dreams. Ernesto arranged for Shirley's ride home and soon asked her on an official date. Their bond grew quickly, spending quality time together in Atlanta's Piedmont Park. Shirley admires Ernesto's honesty, kindness, and genuine care, considering him a true gentleman. With a positive mindset, Shirley embraced new experiences, including a friend's introduction to Ernesto Williams at his Atlanta concierge business in 2013. As they engaged in conversation, their friend discreetly stepped away, allowing Shirley to let her guard down and connect with Ernesto. They shared stories about their pasts and dreams for the future, establishing a strong rapport. Ernesto arranged for one of his company's drivers to take Shirley home, and soon after, he officially asked her out on a date. 
The couple quickly formed a deep bond, spending quality time together in Atlanta's Piedmont Park, engaging in heartfelt conversations and people watching. Shirley admires Ernesto's genuine character, highlighting his honesty, kindness, and handsomeness, making him a true gentleman in her eyes. On the following Monday morning, Strawberry resumed her radio duties, offering guidance to her listeners regarding their relationships. She shared the empowering message, When you make room for love, you discover that you have more than enough space. However, little did she anticipate the fleeting nature of her own happiness, as the man she married and the person she collaborates with on a daily basis would soon become adversaries in her life. The recent incident involving Shirley's husband and Steve Harvey generated significant discussion among netizens, leaving them in disbelief and needing a moment to catch their breath due to the weight of Ernesto's previous convictions. How about you? Do you think Steve Harvey should also be charged for aiding Ernesto in carrying out his crimes? Let us know in the comments. That's all for today. We hope you enjoyed that video, and if you did, make sure to hit like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more videos like this.